Yo. T N T dynamite. Try nitrogen trinoline. Try nitrate trinoline. I know it's something like that. Something along those lines. Is what TNT means. For you and the know. I'm the only TNT that you need to worry about. Alright, so last time I played this game was actually a, a while ago. So I know that I am in the... I don't want to be here. <laughs> so I gotta fight the four kings, essentially. That's really all we need to know. Four Kings runs. Oh, okay, fine. So now I think this way was maybe not as quick, but what the hell? Let that guy attack me. I mean, that's his fault. Look, there's a chance he might have dropped something. There's a really good chance that he might have dropped something. So, I'm just going to go back in. To ensure that I get said item. That was the guy from the from Firelink. Like the first guy. Like go back to like the first second video. I, I'd smack that guy. By accident. I guess he never forgave me. Oh, he did not drop anything. Apparently. But we'll never have to worry about him again. Do I have transient curse? I don't know. I'm going to use one just in case. I did not, see? Kind of running low, but you can purchase them, so it's not a big deal. I play a little bit of this on my, uh, on my spare time, and let's start out. What we need to know is that, yeah, Uncle... Great Uncle Lewis is now at level 15. I figured out you had to modify the weapon before you could change it. So I took it completely up, used the slab that I have to get it where it needs to be. I gotta find this. There's a way in. Maybe it's up here. Totally using Tomb Raider controls too. I've been playing Tomb Raider. We're playing Tomb Raider on the channel. So if you're watching this and you want to see Shadow of the Tomb Raider, the newest game by HP Laura Croft. Oh, okay. All right. All right. I think it's right in here. And then yeah, it's this way. See ya. That brings me down to here. I can choose to fight these guys, but I think I'm just going to practice running now. Because this is what we're going to be doing the majority of the time anyway, is this fucking running. And I need to know this run by heart, right? Okay, you hit me. Congratulations. Alright, let's get in here. This is our first first attempt at the four kit. Almost died. Almost died there. Alright, 
I forgot a giant spiral staircase. I mean, naturally. Good luck. Yeah, I'm gonna fucking need it. Alright, here we go. Why'd I die? I wasn't wearing the ring. <laughs> I wasn't wearing the ring. Which ring is it? I don't have the ring? Grants magic, but has HP, grants attunement slots. I don't have the ring. Do I not have the ring? Is it not, it's not in my bottomless box. Physical defense. No, oh, these are... I don't have any rings in my bottomless box. I don't know where to get the ring. Where do you get the ring? I'm pretty sure there's a ring. That's that's not good. All right, I guess we're going back in. Um wow. That's crazy, man. <laughs> that's that's crazy. Some other other slight changes that we made is I did get my strength up to 50. I think I put like maybe three levels worth of work off camera. Not a whole lot. Nothing's like really significant or anything. Yes, wonderful drink. That was a vic. Can I please just pull the lever? Can I? Yes, that's great. Can I pull the lever? Thank you. Yeah, so... I, th I don't know where the ring is. It may be down here. At least I hope it is. <laughs> I hope it wasn't on the merchant I killed. Is that ring? I know the ring is a thing. There's something you have to wear at least. I know if it if it's not a ring in particular, you know, excuse my ignorance. I'm new to the game. I've seen it played through a couple times, but I'm still new to the game. Hey, hang on. That's a sword. Yes. What do you say? Frank? Oh my God! I don't know where it is. No man's land. Yeah, you can have. Oh, yeah, I got this ember. I think I got that ember from, like, oh, uh, Seath the Scaleless's area. Modify. What does it, it, this change it to? Magic. Magic and, I guess, holy, I assume, and then revert. Come back soon. Smithing helps soothe my nerves. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh wait, I don't need to purchase anything. Let, let me see what he has in his inventory. I don't know if I've even ever showed this guy on camera, but he's here. What do you got? Nothing. Come back soon. You got nothing. Do I really gotta hunt this ring down? Cause I legitimately do not know. I'm, I'm probably gonna have to look it up just to keep it a hundred percent with you at this point. I'm disappointed that guy tried to attack me and had to give his own life. Now that Uncle Louie's level 15 and no longer level 5, like, nothing really stands a chance. I even looked up, like, what the, some of the strongest weapons in this game were. And it turns out that, uh, this club I'm using, if I were to make it lightning, I guess, is, like, one of the strongest weapons in the game. Or if the strongest weapon in the game, perhaps. Yeah. 
Is the ring... Is the ring on the... I feel like I searched this area freaking high and low, though. Give me something. Transient curse. You think that's what I wanted? That is not what I wanted. I don't know if it's safe down there. Like, that could be death. Let's go. So I even went through, like, a lot of these areas and, like, searched, what the hell are you doing? Nobody asked you to be here. What are you doing here? Where'd you come from? Where'd you come from? Where'd you go? Where'd you come from? Where the fuck am I? <laughs> I keep, like, instinctively in, in uh, the Shadow of the Tomb Raider, you have to hold, oh, I know where I'm at, hold down the right stick in order to get, like, orientation to things, and I'm doing a lot of that right now, and it is not working to anybody's benefit. No, 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 no! I fell. Look at the damage output. Ooh, okay. Okay, big boy. You killed me. <laughs> Alright, I got the hubris was up. I gotta look up how to find this ring now. That's that's number one on my um Four Kings Dark Souls. All right, Wikipedia, the greatest thing ever created. I tell you that right now. Uh, Four Kings, and in order to safely survive the abyss, all players host uh, must wear covenant of artorius ring prior to entering and keep it on during the entire fight removing it at any point will result in death the covenant of artorius ring where do you get this ring effect uh, allows you to fight the four kings after killing the great wolf sif So, that means I cannot do the Four Kings until after I beat Sif. I really wanted to fight Sif after I do the DLC. So I have two choices here. I can either do the DLC now so that I can fight Sif. I mean, I do. My weapon is maxed out. I'm not really going to get too much stronger than what I am. Or I could fight Sif now, fight the four kings. And then do the DLC afterwards. And that that's an option too. That's more straight and to the point. I brought us here because I want to do this. This is the next part of the uh the story too. Uh Onion Knight's little fucking uh side quest. We can do this while, while I think about what I want to do next here. So I think I think I'm just gonna go ahead and do the DLC. I'm kind of I was kind of excited to get in there, and I'm pretty sure the DLC starts off with a with a fucking fat boss anyway. So we'll get that boss itch out of my system. I think I think I'll do the DLC. Now this golden giant in the middle here is what we have to kill. That apparently is Onion Knight's daughter, I guess? Excuse me, sir. Did you swing at me or something? No? Just gonna let, just gonna let me spin around you and just kill you that way, huh? I mean, I'm fine with that. If that's the way you want to go out... <laughs> So yeah, we're going to do a DLC, guys, for sure. 
for sure going to do the DLC. Now, this is supposed to be Onion Knight's daughter, apparently. Let's see how she stands up to new and improve Uncle Lewis. Not too well. <laughs> hey! It was you who rescued me. Why, thank you. I am Zeegland of Katarina. I don't know how I ended up in that crystal. It wasn't terrible in there, but I could hop. I must think of some way to repay you. I forget what I'm supposed hey, to tell her. Have you seen my father? You wouldn't miss him. A suit of armor just like mine. Yes, I have seen him. Goodness. I knew he was here somewhere. Well then, now I must find him. Thanks again, truly. Oh. Just stay put and keep out of trouble. I'm glad I could help. Thank goodness. I knew he was here. Well then. Alright, cool. Alright, so I wanted to get that done before we do anything, but we're going to go next to the Great Basin, I think. The Green Basin. The Green Mile. Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks is an American treasure, I guess, right? Like, what do you have to do to become an American treasure? I've been thinking about this a lot lately, lately how, like, adult society and how we live in one and how it, it really is just like a form of like high school like us at the crazy town we're, we we got a couple fans but we're not like big on any set or scale or stage but it's like you know we're, we're not like not cool right <laughs> Which one do I want to go to? <laughs> We're totally not cool. What is it called? The Dark Moon, Crystal Caves, Catacomb, Fire Link. Depths. Oh, I guess I can't. Let's go to Undead Parish then. That's fine. But yeah, it just seems like, you know, like, the cool kids nowadays aren't just like the kids who are on the football team. Even though, no, you don't get me wrong. Those are some of the, still some of the cool kids, but they play professional football. You know, it's more like the musicians, and a lot of these musicians weren't that cool in high school, though, but they found a way. More, more power to them, honestly. You put enough hard work and dedication into any one thing, it seems like, you know, you're bound to find some air success in that. But today's cool kids... You know, they, they definitely sit at the same table and people talk about them because they're rich. It just seems like uh, fame is the same thing as being popular and they're synonymous. Basically, we're basically still teenagers. <laughs> or maybe teenagers are just, you know, what society was doomed to become. Or what, you know, like a reflection of what society is. Kids acting out as adults. Alright. I really, really want to know where this bonfire is again. I know we've been through this before. Dynamite. You've lost this bonfire on like four occasions. Well, yes, I have. And I will continue to lose this bonfire. And I'd appreciate you not to throw it in my face. Right, so it's not over here. That is not where the bonfire is. I thought you were going to attack me. I'm jumpy. <laughs> I am. I'm a little jumpy today. I'm TNT jumpy might. Alright, so this is the correct way to go. Which means the bonfire... should be this way I just want to rest at a close bonfire that's all I really want all I really want to do is have some I found it you see that didn't even take me that long you doubted me you doubted us <laughs> the, the 
crazy townsfolk, <laughs> the hundreds and hundreds of oh, this is the wrong way, the hundreds of crazy town folk. So I gotta beat Sif first. Hmm. We're not gonna do that. Definitely getting into this DLC. I feel like I'm good enough. With the power of this giant fucking hunk of tree I got slung across my shoulder, I feel like I can do anything. So these guys are trivial at this point. <laughs> he says as he takes a, a wallop from one of them. Yeah, these guys are nothing. 700 damage. We've come a long way, boys. <laughs> Not our aim, though. I guess I should be, like, locking on to some of these guys, but, like, why? Why would I? Why do I need to? Alright, let's fucking go. I think that's the way to get to Sif. Oh, God, that... You know, it's terrible. You can tell I haven't been playing a lot of Dark Souls. When the ghost of players pass, it scares and confuses me. That's what we're looking for right there, boys. Portal to another dimension. I also want the item that lies behind it. Probably first. Oh. Alright, some some girl clothes. Candace likes to feel pretty. Now we set this up a couple episodes back. I didn't realize. Uh, well, I had to upgrade my weapon. And there was a couple other bosses I beat. I think we did the Catacomb. We did Nito. And... Pinwheel, I guess, if you want to count that. Alright. Let's light this bonfire. I don't know if we need to kindle it. We'll see how we do against... Uh, be wary of strong poison. Need saint. Try beating to pulp. Tail? Oh, God. That's actually a good point. Should I try getting the tail off of the Manticore the Sanctuary Guardian? It's adorable, big guy. Cute attack as I close in. Oh, man, he poisoned me. Immediately. But I've got good poison resistances. I do kind of want to go for his tail. Oh man, you got lightning boys, huh? Alright, we need to we need to start putting damage on this guy. So fast. What the? He, he, like, reversed. Alright, alright, alright. This guy's not strong, though. And he's not fast. You see that? We got the speed. He doesn't have the speed that we have. Oh my god. Where are you? Alright, 
sip it up. Come on. I'm going to try to get his tail. You know I am. I can't help myself. I fucking got it. <laughs> nice. Oh, you missed. We don't. Get, this guy is not even good. How are you a boss? Get out of here. And I got your tail. Take your soul, too. <laughs> nice. First try. I'm not gonna lie, I was a little concerned that I would embarrass myself. I mean, I did manage to lose to uh, Pinwheel. All right, let's check that weapon out because that's one of those weapons I don't think I've ever even seen. Guardian Tail. It's a strength weapon. It's a whip. Regular move set looks like it's just flips. Okay, let's try to roll. Oh, we're out of stamina. Let's try to roll with it. There's nothing. Roll. There's nothing. Two handed. Dude, this thing is extremely phallic. So basically the same move set as the other one, the other whip, but it's mine. Happy with that. Alright, let's get out of here.